hear about this bull semen? Yeah. So um, I just want to read a headline to you guys. <laughs> what, a, what a segue. I know. Let's <laughs> let's let's read let's read a headline and I want you to guys to just think about the mind of the firefighters as they are heading towards what this. they're heading towards. Massive semen explosion after Blaze hits bull artificial insemination facility. Firefighters forced to dodge projectiles. We got a code red at the cum factory, guys. Suit up. Sounds like a sticky situation. Mm, yeah. Um, I saw this tweet. I mean, it's in Australia, it says, so. You it know. says, we live in a world where there was a semen explosion at a cum factory, and every publication is trying to use words that don't make it sound like there was a semen explosion at, at a, a cum, cum factory. factory. <laughs> 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 That's hilarious. Um, <laughs> I mean, could you, I mean, it's, it's literally like organic material. It's, it's, it's potentially biohazard. I mean, it's, it's bodily fluids. It's blood, piss, shit, jizz. Like it's the, it's all the same, you know, like cool. And if it comes from another animal, that doesn't make it any better. Here's some list of alternate headlines. Jizz explosion, expensive semen everywhere. As far as the eye can see, bull cocky, seam. Semen. Any bur bull sperm lately? That's not that good. Seen, seen any bull sperm lately? Semen any bull sperm lately? Anyways. What's yeah, interesting is like, like how expensive <laughs> I bet that, that fire costs. Like I bet probably like a little 16 ounce vial. Like that's enough to shove inside like a, like a chick cow. You know, I bet one of those vials from like a steed bull, you know, it's probably worth anywhere from 1,000 to 10,000 bucks. Like I, I, I bet like. I know horse jizz, especially if they're racehorses, like racehorse jizz is like 50,000, 100,000. Like, like in order to like get a mare pregnant from like a Kentucky Derby winning like male horse, like you pay tons of money. Yeah. I don't have enough information to conjecture about that. I didn't think that bull semen was that valuable. But Dude, aren't I, you on Farmers Only? Can't you hit up some chicks that you've been hollering at on Farmers Only? Yeah, I'm trying to inseminate them with mine. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, you're not. No, you're not. Yes, I am. I'm not trying to inseminate would, anyone. Would you, would you, if you went to like a bull factory or, or if you went to one of these places and the girl was like, yeah, we need to go milk one of our bulls. And if you successfully milk the bull, I'll milk you. Would you? Would you? Would you jerk off a bull? To get your bull jerked off? Mm. <laughs> no. Yes, you would. Yes, you would. Any sane guy would do that. I guess it depends. I don't on think. That. No. Mm. I guess it depends. I'm not on, like, trying to jerk off a bull. That also sounds just dangerous. I'm not trying to. I'm not trying to get kicked by a bull. I'm not trying to be anywhere near a bull, honestly. Mm. And if like. I'm sure they I'll have never get that. that I'll that never too, get that right? image out of my head. No, it has to be done by hand. Also, whatever. What. Dude, Did, I, have you not I, seen the Jackass movies? They literally have this like little tube thing that they. This like, is a factory. Oh yeah, that's the yeah like the fake pussy. Yeah, like a yeah, yeah. like a fl like a flashlight for horses. I know and bulls. No, I don't know enough about this bull semen a little, factory. A little, a little collection cup. Okay, here's here's my thing. <laughs> I'm not trying to do that, and I'm not trying to have that image ingrained in my head for the rest of my life. Just have Yo, some random but, farmer but chick. All suck you me have off. to do is touch an animal dick, and then your dick gets touched. Huh? I don't want to ah. do that. I mean, but you, you scratch his balls, you, you get your balls scratched. You said any sane person would do that. I don't know, I, man. Any sing, Let me rephrase that. Any AJ, sing, what's, any, your, what's any, your vote any on this? Any single guy should probably do that. I guess if you're scratching someone's balls, you get your balls scratched back. But I mean, if she was not, like a hot farmer chick, not like a red, like a red. If she was farmer. hot, and yeah, I was saying that too. It depends on the chick. As it well. depends on the chick. I feel I don't know, like man. If, if she's like drop dead gorgeous, of course. But if it's some like. Hey, you want to jerk off to this this bull when I'll suck you off? That's a no. For She's me. missing some teeth, chewing some yeah. tobacco at the same time. Yeah, I'd rather just like hire a prostitute. <laughs> That's a thing you can do. <laughs> that is also a thing. That is also a thing. I saw that in Canada, the, ta done that, the tax but... code for being a psychic and for being a prostitute is the same tax code. And I bet prostitutes go in hoping that no one thinks that they're a psychic. And I bet psychics go in hoping that nobody thinks that they're a prostitute. I bet they go both, in where 
like to the tax place, like to like wherever you, you know, Canada, uh, like, like whatever tax code you fall under, like psychics and prostitutes both fall under the same tax code. So I bet all the prostitutes are like, don't, I'm not a psychic. And all the psychics are like, I'm not a prostitute. Well, the psychics don't go in thinking that, uh, hoping like they're, they're not nervous walking in there. Because they're psychics and they can read the people's mind and they know whether mm. they think they're a prostitute or not. That's right. I forgot. Psychics are mind readers. Yes. <laughs> and so they go in and they go, oh, you're thinking I'm a prostitute. I'm not. I'm a psychic. That's how I know. That's how I know. And they were like, they were like, oh, good. Because I was thinking you're a prostitute. And then, and then, if, and then they walk in, they're like, oh, whew. I th thought you might have thought I was a prostitute, but you don't think that. I'm a psychic, by the way. You know, you, you're thinking that I know that. And I also know that because I'm a psychic. Dude, this conversation is so wack. I know, bro. Where did, where, how did we? How did we get here? How did we well, get here? Well, we got here because a bull semen factory exploded. Yeah. Um. And on that note, I don't have anything else to add about bull semen. So mm -hmm. we, yeah. we can move on. I I can add about like a little bit about the the, the psychic stuff. It's like they'll make like a hundred guesses, and if one guesses is, guess is correct, then all of a sudden everyone's like, ooh. Hope you enjoyed that clip. If you'd like to see the full episode, click right here. If you'd like to subscribe, click here. If you'd like more clips, we got two more right over here. <laughs>